the struggle of a traveling baseball writer. That's Paul taking a piss. But yeah, it's pretty much nothing much. Simple motel. We're heading to the game right now. Should be dope. We're running kind of late. But we should be fine. Yo, we just got to the stadium. Parking was five bucks. No surprise. Usually my ballparks are five bucks. Got here kind of late. Pledge of Allegiance was already going on. Have to go to Will Call and pick up some tickets. Check it out. Hopefully there's a front entrance. Looks kind of like the Bakersfield Blaze front entrance. Something that I've noticed so far about this ballpark is that the food selection is crazy. We've got so many different things like turkey burgers and tri-tip burgers. We've got a lot of different types of beers, a lot of types of different lemonades. So far it's been good. Oh, man, I'm just a little tired, but we're doing it. We're killing it. So we should see how fun it should be. We're still walking around the ballpark. My um, sidekick is kind of busy with something else. Doctor's Madness. Okay. Getting hit on by the mascots, though. It's mascot mania today. Out here. So far, there's not that much stuff going on. But I think we might have came through the wrong entrance. No, stop. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's crazy. So far, so good. Getting in was easy. Uh, their office, there's a giant ice cream cone walking over there. Bullpens <laughs> cooped up. Let's call that the chicken hen. So cooped up. So far, bar is pretty cool. Not really much uh, craziness, but it's pretty cool. It's very family friendly. They have like jumpers and stuff for kids. They got memorabilia wins. They got all these kind of stuff. So this is kind of cool. Strict. Overall, it's pretty good. Nice little ballpark. For an eight ball team, can't really ask for too much. What's going on right now? It's a mascot. It's a mascot what? Mascot meeting. Oh, I thought it was just like a fan, like just like running around with it. <laughs> and the grub is real in Modesto. Okay, got a waitress and everything. That was dope. A lot better than A's Coliseum. <laughs> We're out here eating. The food's fucking pretty good. Love it. We decided to move up to the bleachers. There's really no one up here. It's a lot more space to eat, relax. I see a lot of kids running around. Paul made mentioned something really important that the fence net actually goes all the way to the bottom. That's something we really don't see too much around in mostly ballparks, so that's pretty interesting. But yeah, I mean it's fun. I got a lobster roll. Paul got that barbecue chicken and beans. There you go. And the mackerel on is so sick. Yo guys, focus. Don't forget to follow the Around the Ballparks Instagram page for all your updates on where we're at and where we're gonna be next, all right? I know, no, there's not too many people here. Got some Michael Conforto. Like Ooh, it's blowing up. Let's do this. Okay, take me out to the crowd. Buy me some peanuts and cracker jacks. I don't care if I never get back the road.
Root, root for the A's, nuts, and grizzlies. Nah, no Dodgers. Boo, boo. One, two, three strikes here out at the old ball game. Get ready to take over John Durfield Gym this Sunday at July 24. Tickets are buy one, get one free for Sunday's game if you show your Pokemon Go app on purchase of your tickets. Don't miss out on your opportunity to win prizes for all night, as well as catch Pokemon. Views from the six. Hey. Now pitching for the Blaze, number 13, Isaac Sanchez. What's up, guys? We're here at John Thurman Field, home of the Modesto Nuts. We saw the Modesto Nuts take on the Bakersfield Blaze. After a good pitching matchup for seven innings, the Bakers field play scored three runs in the bottom of the ninth inning and took the game home today. Alright guys, the game's over. We got some fireworks going on today. The Bakersfield Blaze scored three runs in the ninth inning to beat the Modesto Nuts. But we're out here enjoying these fireworks tonight, alright?